I think a little bit of a, like a road and we see where it goes where it takes you. Two more hours of fixing something. Okay, well, I don't know. Well, first go ahead. Go ahead. Sure, there. I know what Aquila is. That's the pond district. That's where you take your stuff. Yeah. If you need money. Yeah. Wow, this is beautiful, man. Que lindo. la programación el audio el audio ahí ya está corriendo pero este lo, este audio lo que va a decir son cosas así this is the X-ray one uh -huh. Tell me, why, what made you choose to use the Tico street map and to put Tico sounds? I think it's a, it's a mixture of, of my background because when I was in Japan, Japan is very technological and everything is about pushing a button and popping out a sound of some type. And, uh, and then I, I and also the fact of being an architect, we are always dealing with the city, I am involved with the city. I, Sidewalks, uh, setbacks, and, and the size of blocks. So it made sense uh, for me to, to, to and, and the guy I'm working with to create. He's also an architect, and I'm now starting to get into his culture. So to create something with, with a map, a map of the city, and then what what would be more interesting than to have a map of the city that also would give you another reference, like the sound of the cities. So that's, that's what's going on, a little bit of the city and map. And then coming from Japan where everything is a little bit electronic, and then where cities are very intense. So there you go, you have a little bit of everything. Amazing. Thank you very much. No problem.